Hey everyone, this is Daily Dose of Medicine, and in this video, we'll talk about von Willebrand disease. It's the most common inherited bleeding disorder caused by deficiency or dysfunction of the factor called von Willebrand. It's a protein crucial for pl platelet adhesion and aggregation at the sites of vascular injury and stabilization of the factor eight. We have three different types of von Willebrand disease. The first one is type one. It's due to quantitative reduction in von Willebrand factor protein. Both the concentration and activity of the protein are decreased. Type two is just due to dysfunction of the factor. Type three is due to absent or severely reduced von Willebrand factor we have severe quantitative reduction. The cause is genetic mutation. The gene located on chromosome 12 leading to either quantitative deficiencies like we see in type 1 and 3 or qualitative defect in type 2. And the main signs and symptoms we might see are excessive mucocutaneous bleeding such as heavy menstrual bleeding this is very common presenting symptom epistaxis easy bruising prolonged bleeding from minor wounds and the oral cavity gastrointestinal bleeding and bleeding after dental work childbirth and surgery severe cases may also present with musculoskeletal bleeding including joint bleeding for diagnosis, patient history is very important and we use laboratory tests to measure the antigen of von Willebrand factor, von Willebrand factor activity and factor 8 levels. Many individuals will have normal complete blood count and normal coagulation studies, but with some individuals we might see microcytic anemia, individuals with heavy menstrual bleeding, or gastrointestinal bleeding may develop iron deficiency anemia or iron deficiency with microcytosis. Prolonged APTT, this is a coagulation study, the activated partial thromboplastin time, which is APTT, may be prolonged if the factor eight level is significantly reduced. Also, in some cases, we see thrombocytopenia. In treatment, we, we might use desmopressin, which induces the release of stored von Willebrand factor and factor VIII from endothelial cells used primarily in type 1 and some cases of type 2. Von Willebrand factor concentrates, these are plasma-derived or recombinant products that are used in patients who do not respond to desmopressin or have severe type 3 antifibronolytic agents like trexanamic acid uh, used an adjunctive therapy to prevent mucosal bleeding. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to watch our platelets and anemia related videos I'll be putting on the screen. Join our channel membership to support our channel. And I'll see you on the next video.